lost your WhatsApp messages, whether you have a backup or not, don't worry, I will show you two easy ways to recover them. So let's get started. The first method is recovering with Google Drive backup. So if you have a backup, follow these steps. Firstly, uninstall WhatsApp from your phone. And once you're done, head over to Play Store to reinstall WhatsApp. Then once you're once you done, click on WhatsApp and verify your phone number. So choose your language and then agree and continue. Then input your number. Click on continue and then allow WhatsApp to assess your contacts. Fill up the details to load by itself. And then you will see WhatsApp will automatically look for backups for you. As you can see, Google have automatically found my backup with my account, my email account. So all you need to do is to click on restore and Google automatically restore it from your Google Drive. So I'll just click on restore now. In case your password isn't detected automatically, Google asks for your permission to check your Google storage. So give them permission and then select the account you use to do the backup and click on restore. And that is it. That is how you can recover using your Google account. Now, if you don't have a Google Drive backup, try this method. Let's go to our browser and download a software called Droid Kit. So head to your Chrome and search for Droid Kit. Click any of the drop down and then you can scroll down and read more about the website if you like. If not, let's proceed to download our software. I will drop the link to this website on my video description. Once you've downloaded the software, navigate to data recovery and choose WhatsApp recovery. From here, we're going to pick up our phone and do some setup. Firstly, connect your USB cable from your laptop to your Android. Now go to your phone settings, click on it and search for your phone or your device option. Click on your phone or device option and search for the build number. Click the build number several times, tap on it several times until you become a developer. Unlock developer mode with your device pin and you are good to go. So now you are a developer. Next, go to your settings again and scroll down to system. Once you are here, search for the developer mode. Click on it and scroll down for USB debugging option. Now toggle it on and then press OK. You'll be prompted to allow USB debugging from an address. Press allow. Now draw down the notification center and change the charging type to transfer files or MTTP. Now your Android will be automatically connected with the Droid Kit app on your system. So this will discover your Android device and then you can start. So this is launching and we've been discovered. So we click on start and follow this step. Go to your WhatsApp and make this changes. Follow the guide, click on settings on your WhatsApp, then charts. Now, chat backup. Make sure and make sure the automatic backup is on only when I tap backup, and then that's it. So on your system, you click on next and proceed with the steps. The Droid Kit will guide you through. You can check quick recovery from device, deep recovery from device, data recovery from SD card. So you can decide to send this to your device or to your PC once it's done loading all the files. So that's how you can recover the entire WhatsApp messages with Autobacker. backup. If this helped, like, share, and subscribe for more tech tips. So before I forget, the free versions won't allow you to export the files, but they will show you your files. You are only allowed to export your PC or your device when you are using the paid version. So this is the version button above and you can use it if you have one.